Hi, I'm Brian Krakevich, Senior VP of Media at Cranford Johnson Robinson Woods. We've just released the fourth edition of our annual State of the Media Report. The report provides an in-depth look at the changes taking place in the world of media. So what are some of the changes taking place, you ask? Let's take a look. People are spending more time consuming media each day than ever before, more than 12 hours a day on average. That's an increase of nearly an hour and 20 minutes each day since 2010. Personally, I spend 25 hours a day consuming media, but then again, I'm a media guy. So what is this growth due to? It's due to digital media providing more media opportunities. Consumers now spend more time with digital media on an average day than they do with TV or any other medium, five hours and 16 minutes each day. And the real driving force within digital media is mobile. Time spent with mobile has grown by 487% since 2010, from 24 minutes a day to two hours and 21 minutes a day. And as the price of mobile devices continues to drop, usage will continue to grow. But it's not like people are spending less time with television. The four hours and 31 minutes spent with TV each day represents a 2.5% increase over 2010. And while people may spend more time with digital than television these days, television still reaches the largest audience and controls the majority of U.S. advertising dollars with a 39% share. Digital currently controls about 24% of ad dollars. But there are some signs of TV viewership erosion with people under 35. Marketers have to keep an eye on how digital devices, desktop opportunities, and internet TVs impact viewing as time goes on. Because one day, the younger market will be their core audience. The growth and popularity of the content marketing concept has led more and more brands and marketers to use websites and social media to deliver messages directly to target audiences. A 2013 study from Unisphere Research found that 71% of surveyed marketers reported publishing original content to their websites and then pushing it out through social media. There's good reason for this. A survey by the Custom Content Council found that 61% of respondents said they feel better about a company that delivers custom content, and they're also more likely to buy from that company. Additional research has shown that interesting content is one of the top reasons people follow brands and businesses in social media. Social media, meanwhile, continues to grow. The latest numbers from Pew Research Center's Internet and American Life Project show that 73% of U.S. adults online use social networks, and almost 42% now use multiple social networks. Radio continues to be a solid performer, as its share of advertising dollars continues to grow slightly each year, and the time people spend with it remains steady. Even though Internet radio listenership through vehicles such as Pandora and Spotify has nearly doubled since 2009 to 120 million listeners, broadcast radio remains the dominant force with over 240 million users. Print ad revenues and readership continue to decrease very slightly each year. And while digital newspaper and magazine readership is growing fast, it's not making up for the losses in print circulation. Publishers have to figure out how to grow their digital readership enough to make up for these losses in print. The driving force behind outdoor advertising growth is the digital billboard. Even though just 2% of board locations are digital, they control 20% of all outdoor advertising. Digital boards are also appealing to marketers as production costs are lower and messages can be changed out quite easily. As technology advances and becomes more accessible to more people due to lower prices for products and services, consumption patterns will continue to shift toward digital media. If a major ground shift in pricing suddenly occurs, or if an ultra-advanced connected television hits the marketplace, there could be a sudden and massive shift in consumption habits. Our recommendation for marketers? Keep a sharp eye on the changing landscape of media usage and continue to integrate digital media into your media mix at a conservative rate.